Hello and welcome to Quick Looks at the Casual Hour. My name is Bobby and tonight we are taking a look at Warhammer 40k Dark Tide. Joining me- Bobby, there's the a skull on your face. There's a skull on oh. your face, Bobby. No, that is, that is, uh, I'm from a little game called Death Stranding. You know who I am. Say my name. Oh, hey. Hard man. Okay. Yes, of course. Uh, joining me, the casual crew, Chase and Johnny. Hello, Chase and Johnny. Bridges, bridges connect. Bridges land connect. People, Sam. And zealots. Uh, we're we're gonna take a look at this uh this new game from you know the this brand new series that does not have anything else in it called Warhammer. And uh, what do you boys know about Warhammer 40k Dark Tide? Well, I, uh, you know me, I'm I'm a miniature painting fiend. That's what okay. I do. I okay. do all the time. Uh, no, I've I've never touched anything Warhammer. It's always seemed like a, a scary thing that the that the the zealots do, the zealot preachers do. Uh, but yeah, this is this is Warhammer 40k Dark Tide, a video game, not a physical game. But uh, it came out November 30th, 2022. It's, uh, who the hell made it? Fat Shark. Yep, Fat Shark developed and published it. Um, have you guys played any Warhammer of any sort, video, tabletop, uh, or otherwise? Yeah, I, I played, played some... Go ahead, Bobby. Go, go for it, Johnny. Uh, I played uh, a Space Marine game on the 360. Uh, Bobby and I played a little bit of Vermintide 1 and 2 together. Yep. And now this one. I played the other uh, 40k game this year. The uh, turn tactical one, right? Yeah, the turn-based one. It's really yeah. good. I like that one quite a bit. Um, That's what I heard. Yeah, this is more akin to like a Left 4 Dead compared to, you know, what we had with that. Right. One. Yeah, like this is... This is like a semi-sequel to Vermintide. Vermintide was in the Warhammer universe, yes. which is the fantasy stuff, and this is the Warhammer 40k universe, which is space marines and whatever this large <laughs> thing is An with you. An ogre. Sure, sure. sure. Sweet bowl cut. Yeah, it's like uh, <laughs> like Larry Moe and Curly got, yes. uh, got <laughs> rolled into one. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah. Uh, so this I'm is... Uh, Moe Mo ate Larry and Curly. <laughs> he said, hey, I'm hungry, bitch. I'm just going to hang out behind him. Thanks, Moe and Curly. Uh, yeah. So I will say that this, is this to me, feels... There's guns in it and there's abilities, but this certainly feels more like a melee-driven game to me, right yeah, out of the gate. Melee focused, for sure. Um, big, big hordes swarming you. Objectives. And that was the same for Vermintide, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, it's it's a pretty brutal game. Is there a chainsaw sword in this game? There is. That would be cool. There is a chainsaw sword in this game. Okay. Nope. That's that's like the one thing I know about Warhammer 40k. Uh, it's a, a very brutal game. Very graphic. You're mm -hmm. dismembering and people are full of maggots. They yeah, bleed they maggots, actually. Sure. Don't we all? Uh, I have uh, one I ability. Mean, speaking, of, speaking, I'm sorry, speaking of graphics, you guys are playing this on at the personal computer where you can get the most graphics. Sure. Um, it, it is. Might, don't, it might don't not be ready. Much, though, you yeah. Might <laughs> you might not uh, want to do all the graphics. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, it is not out yet for Xbox Series X and S. That is a that is a TBA on that one. Yes. Uh, and maybe they're gonna wait oh, until God. they figure out how to finish this. So I'm being attacked by the consoles. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. Yeah, it's it is uh it's rough in that sense. Get off my friend. Jesus. Don't you hurt my dog. Don't, I'm going to hurt your dog. Get yeah, out of here, dog. I think, I think the dog's kind of hurting you. That was uh, terrifying. <laughs> so it, it is a game that you need to stick together for sure. And yeah. there will be mini bosses, big bosses, and it'll be like, hey, you need to maintain this uh, vicinity while you're fixing this repeater or whatever it would be or radio signal and then more and more dudes come and if you don't kill the right dudes they trigger more dudes it's oh oh hot uh it's uh, problematic fire on the ground 
and uh, I'm playing as a zealot here and there's some really nice things with that class that you get some some buffs that will help you uh, survive like more passive like every 90 seconds you'll get a little bit of a burst that helps you withstand damage I've got a rush attack that lets me go uh, sprint towards people and do a little bit more damage it looks a little bit like that I can hit a little bit harder uh, I, I really like when this game hits with the gameplay it works it works well unfortunately there are uh, as we called out some technical hiccups with this that aren't yeah aren't quite there yet i've had uh lots of crashes with this last time we played this big bastard did not go well. shit it's not going well here let's see if i can stun him there are, there are some guns you you have is there a is there like a dune style reason of why uh melee weapons are still used oh dude i i have not I even like but, began to like well, go into the lore haven't, you haven't <laughs> uh read somebody's heresy or whatever the hell no no I, I do know that in this universe uh or in this game rather like we are prisoners that they're yes. sitting in these places and i have to imagine that making making and maintaining melee weapons is a fair bit cheaper than uh, you know, supplying ammunition and stuff in, in unlimited quantities, so. I think they do a pretty good job with it. There's four classes right now at launch. Uh, as you can see, there's the Ogren, which is the big tanky dude that's with us. Uh, the Zealot, there's a, a Freaker, I think that's what they're called. They're more of like a wizard and caster. You they guys do are my freakers. A freaking in the sheets. Freaker in the sheets. By the, she by the way, all Horus Heresy was what I was thinking of. That oh, is a, yes. That is a Warhammer 40k book series, which I, I am know. probably going to read some of the sci-fi next year. That'd yeah, of honest. course you are. Isn't it based off Margaret Thatcher? Didn't you say there, that, Johnny? I, that's what I heard. Yeah, yeah. there's some, some Thatcher-esque politics in here or reaction to that. Yeah, because it, it started in the 80s uh, whenever she was still alive and ruining England. Um, there's also they, uh, they they can ruin themselves without her. That's we true. don't need your help. They've proven that <laughs> barely. I mean, not like we can talk. Our country's also kind of fucked. Oh but, shit! I mean, oh shit! Oh, hey, speaking of fucked, <laughs> get fucked. Yeah, man. When this when this runs well, it it's a lot of fun. But and every time I play it now, I'm nervous that it's gonna like. Because we've gotten to the close to the end of several runs and my game has crashed. Yep. And you do you are allowed to try and rejoin mid session, but if someone drops out, it tries to fill that spot for you. Mm. Yes. Um, so, I mean, can, can you ever do that? Like I, I have to bring everything back into Destiny terms. But when I'm when so, I'm playing a strike, sometimes I'll uh, join on a group that's over halfway done or even at the boss, and I just come in and I. Like a little damage, and I go, oh yeah, I finished yeah. that strike all, people, all by myself. People can absolutely do that. Nice. And if they can't find somebody, they'll put a bot in to help out. Okay. So I, That's I nice. do, yeah, I do appreciate that. It's not always the best, but they do, they do focus on trying to keep the teams balanced out. And I have noticed um, there's always a good mix, like through matchmaking. I'll see like the Ogren. I'll see a few different of the classes represented here to make sure that you're getting all the things that you need to be successful in a run is there a story here other than your prisoners and your i assume trying to escape no uh, we yeah. are in a hive which is like a huge city um and we are sent in to clear out these groups of people so uh we're oh, so escaping you're not, you're not in a prison you're out you're just of the prisoners prison. There was a an event that took place at said prison, and then uh, you were able to. They're like, okay, you might be worth you might be worth us having you help out with things. So get so over like here. Suicide squad esque. Exactly. That's exactly what it is. Highly disposable. Shit. Um, they're just sending you in, and they don't really care if you live or die. So who are who are these people you're killing? 
Uh, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know, dude. I, I've just been shooting shit, and I've had. I don't want to talk too much shit, but I think we have to be fair here as we talk about it. It's been a technical mess. We did the beta. It was really poorly performing on PC. They've pulled back console release. We've had a lot of crashes when we were trying to do this. So I do feel a lot of my energy at this point. And this is December 6th at the time of recording. This has only been out since the 30th of November. I feel like I've been fighting with the systems to try and get it to work. And uh, it's a bit of a bummer because there's a lot of good bones here. There's just some stuff getting in the way of getting to those bones. So I haven't spent a lot of time like, how deep does this go? And it is something where it's more multiplayer driven. So I haven't spent a lot of time learning about why we're doing what we're doing or who we're up against. So you are a, a zealot priest class, Bobby, is that correct? That is correct. And, yeah. and what specific what specific is going on with your class? I think you kind of mentioned it a little bit, but... Uh, you, I, I think that this is like a good all-rounder class. You are, especially like being new to the series and playing through it, I can withstand. I get some immunity and some ability to like withstand big blows that would normally take out others. And uh, I get... Uh, I don't know all of my future abilities. I, I unlock the first tier of the skill tree uh, when I hit level five, which if we successfully do this run, I think I'll hit and we'll get to see a little bit more of it. Um, but I don't have the exact place, the class breakdown information right now outside of, I read a few things online about if you're new and getting started, Zealot offers a pretty uh, fair approach to like balance of skills and uh, powers, so I, I thought that was cool. How many uh, classes I, are there? Four right now, uh, more to come from what I've heard. And I think that that was some of the backlash that they've they've launched with others. Let's see here, what do we gotta do for this mission? I don't even quite know. Uh, there's a skull in that computer, Bobby. That's, my, that's how computers look, Chase, don't you know? Uh, I mean, you guys just helped build me a PC, and uh, I don't remember seeing a skull go into it, so... Oh, it's there. Okay. Yeah, it's just, it's hidden. It's like a, it's like um, a, a halo one, skull. You gotta look for it. Yeah, okay. One thing that is kind of cool, uh, when you're making your character, you're creating this whole backstory for them. And, like, yeah. how they ended up oh, in shit. this prison. Um... So it's like you pick the planet you're from. Uh, it's like four or five different traits. So, so you're making all this backstory for yourself, but you said the game doesn't have much in the way of story itself. I, I've not like gone on missions that are story missions. It's literally like run through here. It's like strikes on destiny. It's the best way yeah, I can explain like, it. There's there's lore involved in there somewhere, but like I'm just here to chop dudes up with this sword you know? yeah, like the, I mean, you're you're the, i mean I, don't take this derogatorily you guys are are ignorant to the story of warhammer so yeah. you guys are just kind of playing through it and not really maybe understanding the easter eggs and story mm -hmm. bits that are that they're peppering through yeah, exactly. yeah it's not what like i i did not say oh <laughs> warhammer i want to learn all about it I yeah. was like, this is like a fun game that I can kind of shut my brain off with and kill dudes while hanging out with Johnny and friends. And that's, I'm, I'm sure that I'll get into stuff, but dude, like I couldn't even tell you out of the hundreds of hours, like hundreds of hours I spent playing Destiny over the years, what the fuck's going on in Destiny either. So would you like, like to know what the fuck's no, going on in Destiny? No, I've, I've stayed pure. <laughs> Um, I didn't want to have to, you know, read cards to understand the lore. Well, you understood that the robot man died. Maybe. I mean, that was, that was a big deal. Nathan Fillion died. He did. I know that there's wizards on the moon. True. There, there were and continue to be. And I know that the moon's haunted. Um. It, it was and continues to be. Nice. Don't go to the moon. Moon's dead. Yeah. Rasputin's back now. Oh, okay. Yeah. He, he never left. Uh, he turned himself off. I wish oh, I yeah. could. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> like, I don't want to go away forever. 
but I just want to yeah. disappear for a little bit. I get you. You don't you don't want to be around anymore. Yeah. Um, how long would you say these runs go? Thirty minutes. Just, okay. Oh, well. that, that's about what what uh, Left 4 Dead was. Yeah, they're. It, 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 if you get a good crew that's able to like move through things, um, you do all right. Like I've only played with uh, up to three people at a time. Like you can have a team of four. So like me, Jason, and Johnny played this one time, and uh, it was not performing well. Like we didn't even get th through a mission because Johnny couldn't load into it correctly. Um, so we'll we'll go a little bit further uh, and see how it goes. Like I don't know quite long how long we've been recording for. Uh, do you like, do you pick up or scrounge weapons or something? So you pick up like something that gave you stamina, bullets, but... bullets and like health and ammo. Uh, the weapon yeah. stuff, there's a currency system with it, so you are unlocking weapons that you can then purchase if you want to through these runs. So like okay. this sword, I've got it'll it does like a pretty good job. Like hey, you've currently got like a sword that does 89 damage. This one does 114. Do you want to equip it or buy it? And there's different types. There's like daggers that are very fast. Like this is a heavy sword, so it's a slower attack. There's battle axes. There's SMGs, assault rifles. There's a good variety of weapons that you can find uh, your rhythm with, which is great. And there's even like certain vendors that I haven't figured out like what they offer because they don't they're not unlocked to me until like you get to level 11 and I'm only a level a level four mm -hmm. so they they do kind of spread things out progression wise this guy looks big Guardian. get him big boy get him mo We'll keep going for a little bit longer. I don't know if we'll finish the run, though. Oh, that does not sound pleasant. Whatever that is. Yes. I I think that the game looks pretty good, too. It is kind of muddy in its colors and palette. Um, I haven't found a lot of variety in some of the... the I mean, it's, it's just this oppressive... Yeah. I feel like that's... Universe. Yeah, yeah, like that is, that is not so much a fault of the art direction as it is... Right, right. ...just what the environment is. Uh, I don't know where Delta 175 is. That's where we're supposed to move forward to. Let's see if I can find it. I'll give you a hint. It ain't here. It ain't here. You lost, boy? We'll keep moving up. One of us will find it. Okay, that's not it. I don't think... They're following me though. Like I know the if way. You, if you want my uh, destiny tip here, uh, it's go to a place where you find. Uh, new I found it. Okay. That, that's usually a helpful thing. Is if there's if there's dudes to kill, you're going the right way. Get away from me! I don't like you. I don't like the way you look. Hey, this guy. This guy seems fun. I don't even think he's the main baddie here. Maybe he is. Okay. I'm. I'm hurt. I need we to get. We got lots Shit. of ads. See that? I'm gonna focus on them for a second because I am about to drop. Get away! Get away! Get away! Get away! Let me get a. Give me a stun grenade. Why is this? Why does this guy keep hitting me? <laughs> okay, he's gonna. He's you, gonna for real. He's gonna for real kill me unless this. Get him, big guy. Yeah, Bosnian long pipe. Okay. So oh, this is interesting. Didn't do it. Uh, you're gonna see that my character is now going into a prison area. Um, so let me get over here on Johnny and we can watch Johnny. Um, somebody can go to my, my body, which is alive now. I've just been put back in prison and they can bust me out. So I can be brought back into this mission. We'll see if that happens. There I am. Okay. I see you. You see me? Okay. I'm going to go back to spectating you. There you are. Oh, Jesus, Johnny. There's a lot of people there. Ooh. Jesus. God. Get that, that. That big guy needs to start swinging. Keep swinging, dude. All right. Uh, how far away am I? I see you. Okay. Do you see those guys? Oh, thanks, Johnny. I'm back. I'm back, bitches. Don't ever talk to me or my son again. Thanks, Johnny. Appreciate it. 
demon host guy? Or? No, no, he's still he's down there being around. an asshole. Okay. I have healing right here if you need it. Sweet, I, I do need that. Uh, our big guy's getting thrown around. We need to go. All right. So, is the big demon dead? I don't. I don't think we killed it. I don't either. Maybe we did. I certainly didn't. I wasn't around for that. But it looks like it, it looks like we're moving forward. So that's the other thing that's a little strange, Chase. You called it out earlier. It's like, hey, do you get stuff for drops? So in the middle of the, all this, like we just had a boss fight. There's just not anything that comes with it. Like you just keep moving. Yeah. And I mean, Leopard Dead didn't have loot exactly, but as you were going through and progressing, there would be times where it goes, oh, maybe a shotgun would be better for this section and I can choose to pick up the shotgun or hey, I didn't have to use my med pack on the last one, so somebody else can use this med pack that we just found on the ground. Like, they, they wouldn't be things that would carry over from run to run, but it would give you some variety in performing a run that you'd have other things you could switch to and find and do. Yeah, and we're... Crash for you, Johnny? It did. Oh, nice. boy. So let's see if Johnny can get back in here. Um... I, I don't know if there's a bot, right? Yeah, there we go. There's the bot. That's the bot. Yeah, Felicia. Uh, bot by Felicia. I'm glad that. Did I do it right? You did it. You did well. Nice, nice. You did well. You did. You did good, pig. You done good. Um, let's we'll see if Johnny gets back in here. Um, that's, and that's the problem. Like here we are. We're we're making pretty good progress into this. Uh, I would say we're nearing the end of this run. And that seems to be where this thing has been crashing the most. And that's that's really shitty. Uh, I want to call out we're playing this via um, Game Pass on PC. And I know things can be super frustrating. Hopefully this gets fixed. I'd also point out you and I are using computers that are no slouches by any means. Yeah. So this isn't... I mean, I have to wait in a queue now. Okay, here we go. Reconnect. See if it lets me rejoin. So, yeah, no! I, God damn it. You, um. Uh, yeah, you got trapped there, Bobby. I. Thanks, Chase. That's. You yeah, are. Just, you are so. You know. Very helpful. That's what I pride myself on. Uh, I think you pride yourself on something else, but we'll save that for a podcast. Uh. Somebody, please come and get me. He's here. The big man, he's here. There we go. Big man. He's just like. He just, kind of, he just kind of tapped him on the head. And the guy fell over. That's I don't know. Good. Oh, hi. What's this? Uh, it looks like we need to put these in something. I think. Oh, okay. These are like batteries or something. Yeah. I thought God it was like it. a big rocket launcher or something. But that's all right. I was hoping it would have been Jesus. That would have been a dream. God damn it. <laughs> hey, Johnny, Johnny's welcome back. back. Uh, let's see here. I'm moving. Is Johnny just back in body and not in voice? No, I'm here. Okay, good, good. I'm just, I'm pissed off. I don't. He, he's mad. In all fairness, everybody who's, who's watching this quick look, we told ourselves that we were not going to play this anymore until it was fixed. And, uh, we decided to go ahead and do the quick look because why not? But also it's, I think important, like, we do these quick looks for a lot of reasons and it's important to highlight what's working for folks and jesus why yeah, you should this is the public service yeah there's been a trend of games look games are hard to make i know that much please let me get this in here there we go uh but there's been some issues with games maybe coming out a little half baked this year hot. wow that hurt um, so yeah, this one, I think from what I've seen on their prior games, there's a pretty good follow-up. Like they're pretty active on engaging with community, listening to feedback, working through th some things, but this is certainly needing a little bit more time in the oven. 
uh, the, the beta ran pretty poor. This is better than the beta, but not where it needs to be by a long stretch. Damn, got another net. I hate those nets, man. All right, do we get, we need to get one more sample, it looks like. I don't know where to get that from. And not sure. Um, I don't know how close we are to the end, but uh, I do have to get out of here in about four minutes. Gotcha. Um, well, we can wrap up if you want. That's fine. Oh, there's a dog. Watch out. Oh. Okay, I found it. Down, Fido. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we can... Um, Bosnia and Longpipe's going to be so disappointed when you guys ditch out. <laughs> yes, they, they certainly are. I I just want to see where that other piece might be. Oh, yeah, it's this sample thing. Um, I don't think we're going to be able to get it, y'all. So we can, we can back out if needed. That's fine. Uh, we'll quit. Leave the mission. Um, all right. So this has been a quick look at Warhammer 40k Dark Tide. Uh, buyer beware. Maybe check it out on Game Pass if you have that service to save yourself some coin. But in its current state on uh, very high-end PCs, this game runs not so well. Uh, and it's more than just some stutters and frame rate dips. This is actual, as Johnny encountered tonight, hard crashes to desktops. And in every the game, time I played the game. Yeah, every basically. time he's played played the game, that's happened. Um, so we've had we've had some structural problems <laughs> with building building out these characters in these runs because they are long. And as you can see, if you do fail out of it, uh, you get nothing from that, no XP. So they don't even carry over for for that, which is a bummer. So um, I, I enjoy the loop quite a bit. I think the gameplay at, at its core is fun and engaging. I like the lore that I've experienced so far, which has been very, very minimal. Uh, I like the look of this game quite a bit, but I will say all that needs to be further fleshed out before committing large chunks of time right now. So we'll, we'll maybe stream something with this again in the future as they, they patch it and do some updates, which characters and DLC and all that stuff will be there. But if you want to watch us play it in the future, twitch.tv slash casual hour Mondays and Fridays at 10 30 PM central is where you could probably find that happening. If you've enjoyed this quick look, we put them up Tuesdays and Thursdays at 10 AM central. Uh, you can find all of our previous streams. So if you want to see more about, uh, some of our Twitch streams or podcasts that we do, you can find those where podcasts are at wherever you listen to your podcasts, or you can watch it live on Wednesdays, all kinds of good stuff happening with our show. Uh, this has been again, a quick look at, Warhammer 40k Dark Tide, Johnny and Chase, thank you for hanging out. And Johnny, sorry that it crashed. Better luck in the future.